Okay. This is for like, well, this was originally for Windows 10. And Windows 11 suffers from this problem. There would be a time where you can't, your network is slow, it's just, there's nothing you can do about it. So this is a batch file. So batch files, um, the axi key, that's the key with the A's in the circle. I mean, you don't have to do it that way. You can actually run it without it. So you echo off, echo space off. You can do net view if you want to, and that will bring up your network. Or best yet, you can go IP config back, um, space forward, forward slash flush DNS. You run that, that cleans out that. Uh, the next part there, it doesn't work with Windows 11, so we can admit that. Next thing is net sh space int space ip space reset space reset. Okay, we really don't need that because that what that does is that resets and then it goes into a text file. This is the important one. Net etsh win socket reset. You gotta reset the reset socket. This one resets the firewall. It doesn't remove it, but it resets anything in there. Those are the only ones you have to worry about. The rest of it, don't worry about it because the rest of it is for the registry. A lot of these features don't work. This is something that I did from Windows 7. It still works on 10. Sometimes the wind second gets corrupt. You don't know what causes it. It could be anything. I can't tell exactly what it is because it could be anything. But this is how the only way around this is to to take off the NIC drivers. So you go in device manager where your network card is, right click, uninstall. Then um, don't do it now when I'm talking, but then you would get, lose your video feed. Okay, so that's what you do. And then you would re reboot the computer. You could might be able to right click on the top of the device manager, the first icon, and hit. Um, you know, it'll check to see if anything's installed, and then it will install what is necessary. But it will, it will install the, the now NIC drivers. Don't ever delete. You only want to uninstall them. Delete, then you have to pull it down. It takes time. So you understand what we're doing here? We are cleaning the networking, the wind socket, and flushing the DNS. You can reset the firewall. I think that's the problem. The other features don't bother touching. I mean, you might trip on to play with it, but it's not going to work. But NetView will bring up the way your network is set up now. Sometimes the wind socket gets corrupted. So that's, you're going to reset it. That's the command to reset it. Okay. Any questions about this? Just let me know. More videos to come. That's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.